a good American player. But a little bit small. Small, small boy. Who's so small, so fragile. A light as hell, so you would say it's a pushover, but goes by. I mean, I'm a little guy, so of course, they, you, know, you know, then they can push me around. And coaches sometimes said he wouldn't be good enough because he's so small, but I proved all the people wrong. The best spell from the PC event Beasley. I wish I could speak Dutch more so I can understand what they're saying. <laughs> The Marcus Beasley, you see him here, and next time he's there, as quick as, as water. If he goes into the field, then uh, all the stadium goes to Marcus Beasley. He always talked about going to Europe from the time he was younger, and I thought DeMarcus was pretty special when I first saw him playing in the sixth grade because his speed, the other factor was how tough he was. DeMarcus has always been very confident. He was always pushing himself. I tell you, this kid, even at nine, could not be distracted by guys that were trying to take his legs out, by people who were yelling at him and, and cussing him. Left footed, talented, fast. He was 18. He was probably his 10th cap. You would never have guessed by looking at him five minutes before the game, like he was walking in the park. These great players, they have this kind of, some people think it's arrogance. He's like a raging bull. Attacks and attacks and attacks. You can't tell Bees no. In every level he's played with, he's opened eyes. I'm going to Europe to play. Finally getting there. What that betreft, I think everyone here on the bedrijf will know that I'm going to play. If you look at Holland, there's three big clubs, and PSV is the number one of those. The last five years, they've been champions. The club has a good history of doing the right thing with foreign players. They gave me a lot of love when I came in. It was, it was great. Playing, being over here, you're, you're a celebrity. You know, I don't think of myself as a celebrity, but in my city, I, I kind of am. People look up to us like people look up to basketball players. They'll just kind of call his name and he'll go, you know, what's up? You know, I kind of have to stand back a little bit, like, oh my God, you know, <laughs> he's just DeMarcus. <laughs> I wanted to be a better football player. And to do that, I figured for myself, I needed to come to Europe and play against better players and be around a lot of people that eat and live and breathe football. And if we lose a game, I mean, people are crying. The whole city shuts down if we lose a game. He's okay, but he's uh, not playing too much. I think it has been a tough time for him because he wasn't always with the first 11. It was tough this year because I got injured in the beginning and I was out for four months out of the six. So it was tough to get into the lineup and you know get playing. Yeah, it's frustrating. It messes with your confidence a little bit, you know. This summer in Germany means a lot to him because of the injury, you know, and the fact that he has something to prove. I don't want to be the same player I was four years ago. I'm older, I have a lot more experience, so they don't look at look for me to step up. He just has this unbelievable feeling for the team and to be a part of that. I mean, it's just an amazing dream for him. I love going back and playing for my country. When we get together, it's all love. You know, we just go out there and we play. You know, we, we laugh, joke, have fun on the field, and when it's time to get serious and play our game, we play. You know, I take pride in to wearing my colors. I never take it for granted, ever. He's a kid that strived to get to something, kept fighting, kept fighting, and look at what happened.